Hi, I'm Jared Matthews, and I am the assistant to the artistic director of the Estonian National Ballet. I am currently in my fourth season, having joined the company in 2019. Today, I'm going to be talking about the email portion of the application process when you're wanting to audition for a company. In my three and a half seasons, I have seen nearly 2,000 email applications, and I feel sometimes dancers are making mistakes which can cause them to be overlooked. I would like to give a few tips on what I think will be a more successful approach on how to send that email out to companies. I feel it is important that a dancer only submits what the companies have asked for if they put out an audition notice. Like the corporate world, if you don't follow the direction, sometimes companies will just completely disregard your email. So if they have specific requirements, please only send those requirements. I think this will help you to make it past the first stage. It is important for the dancer to realize what this email is doing for them. This is usually the preliminary stage of the audition application. This email is gonna lead you to either be invited to take company class as a private audition or to be invited to an open audition at a specific location. So I think it's important to keep this email simple, very straightforward, and make it as easy as possible for the person receiving the email to see all your information, videos, and attachments. For your CV, I recommend using a PDF format. Most computers and operating systems can easily open this file. I would include your headshot on your CV and a summary of your dance career or dance education. Try to keep it to one page so it is very easy for the person opening the CV to read all your information and see it at one glance. Dance pictures are there so that a company can see your proportions and lines. If the company doesn't specify, I recommend using two or three dance pictures only for your audition application. The dance video is the most important part of the email application. This will show a company your coordination, musicality, and technical ability. Try to keep the video under 10 minutes and only provide what the company specifies. Here at Estonian National Ballet, we are currently asking for male audition applications, one classical variation, and specific center work. For other companies, I would recommend one classical and one contemporary solo and center work combinations. Make sure your video is not password protected and use a platform like YouTube that is easily accessible and a company can share directly with other colleagues to see your video. One final thought, send a practice email to friends or family so you can see how your email is being read when you send it out to a company. Are all the attachments there? Is the video link working? How does the email read? This is very important so that you know exactly what the company is seeing when you send that email. Timing is always important for auditioning. Don't get discouraged if you are not invited to take company class or invited to the audition. I wish everybody a successful audition application process and all the best for your career.